everyone and uh, welcome to a new video if you're new here my name is Mohammed. we continue our tra our training and the preparation for elastic certified engineer exam and uh, in the last video uh, we start about this uh, or start talking about this uh, topic and uh, we have this defined or discuss the the settings and uh, today we will talk about uh, about the mapping with that being said uh, let's jump to our documentation again a reminder during the exam, you will get uh, an access at any time <clears throat> to the uh, to the documentation. So you need to get comfortable with the documentation, and you uh, you like have to be uh, quick when you search for something in the documentation because it's too it's too complicated and too long. Um, so about the mapping, uh, what's the uh, what's the mapping? The definition here of the elastic they say that uh, the mapping is the process of defining how a document and field. <clears throat> It contain are uh, stored and indexed. In another word, um, uh, in a, in a, in a mapping, when we uh, index a document, right, we have the field and we have the type of the field. So um, uh, this is what we uh, talk about uh, about, or this is what uh, what we mean about uh, the mapping. If we uh, if we don't define the mapping, that's okay. Um, Elasticsearch will, by default, um, uh, define a mapping, right? Let's imagine, for instance, you have you have this document. Let's say you want to index this one. So let's say get uh, in the demo. We call a doc. We give it an ID, right? And here we said, let's say name. And here I said. Value right here. If I check the if I check the the mapping, and let's take like this mapping. If I run a mapping like this, right, it's uh, it's empty. But now let's I will index this document. Right, we have one document in our index. Now if I extract the mapping again, it will this time will not be empty. It will come with the, with the mapping. So the mapping I have the field. And this field have two types, one as a text and the second one as a keyword, right? This is the default behavior of Elastic. If you don't define a mapping, Elastic will define a mapping automatically and it will, like Elasticsearch will predict the type. You will like see this is a string between double quotes. It's, um, uh, it's a string, right? So now let's index another, another document. So right in the same index. I say doc and give another ID, right? And here date, let's say it's just like this. Date of birth, something like this. So here I will give, for example, is to any uh, 10, for example, 20, 10, something like this. So if I index this one, right? And I extract the mapping, and here, if we see the second field, which is date of birth, it's text and keyword, <coughs> which is not correct for me. Like I want, I want it to be indexed as a date, not as a text. I want, for example, later when I use or when I search my data, I can ask questions like, give me all the names or all the users that are date of birth are between 2010 and 2020. It, uh, uh, 2010 in, and uh, 2020 and this is not doable if we if we keep it as as this like we cannot uh, search for a range if it is text it have to be a, a date and that's why we need to define uh, sometimes or uh, during the exam or even in uh, production sometimes you need to define your own mapping to avoid this uh, problem right so now let's delay the index right uh, demo I'm just Delete it like this, and I will define it again. Here we go. And now, instead of um, instead of doing uh, like this, we or instead of keeping the uh, Elasticsearch guess the uh, the mapping or define the mapping, I will define it by myself. So how I do it? Uh, how I uh, how I do it? So it's uh, easy. So we go. So here is the. Uh, uh, mapping is empty now let's define it so put the name of our index right and here I call the mapping and here open a bracket here 
properties. Right, so one second, so I do this. Properties. Sorry, we open the bracket and not double quotes. Okay, here we go. Uh, field, so here it will be the name between double quotes. So it's name and here open brackets type type and here we give the type so the first one is text right and the second one i will i want to be uh, a date i want to make it a date so date of birth right like this and type will be indeed so if we run this now acknowledged and if i extract again the mapping so here we have text right or here we have date uh, for date of birth and the second one is uh, is a uh, text Right, let's go to the mapping um, during the uh, the exam or during the uh, the topics we will have uh, another uh, this one we will have another uh, point or where we will uh, dive more in the mapping but this is a high overview about the mapping and what's the benefits of it for sure we have a different type we have uh, we, we have dynamic uh, mapping we have explicit explicit mapping we have a lot of uh, things to talk about or to discover about the mapping but we will not talk about it in this video uh, we will keep it in the uh, uh, in the right one with that being said let me know in the comment section if you have any question and we'll see you in the next one